Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a meal plan and grocery haul video. Um, in my last video, I went through all of uh, my pantry and my fridge and um, cut up all the produce and like all of that and just to see like what I had in my pantry and in my fridge to see what I needed. Um, and then I made out my menu for the week. So this is the third week, I think. Yes, the third week that I have done this um, and I'm really loving it. Um, you know, just going through everything that I have and seeing what I can use. Um, so that way we're not being wasteful. Um, I'm really tired of throwing out things that have expired or you know produce that has gone bad and so I started doing it this way and I've really liked it so far so I plan to continue um, but yeah I made my meal plan and then I went through looked at the different meals and um, wrote down the things that I needed from the grocery store um, based on you know what I have at home already um, and then besides the things that I wrote down on my grocery list I don't plan on getting um, a lot of times when I go grocery shopping you know I'm like oh I see let me get this and let me get that and then it, you know it it adds up and so the past two weeks when I've gone grocery shopping I stick to everything on the list and if it's not on the list I don't get it and then I just let myself get one thing that is not on the list. Um, so kind of like a compromise with myself. So I started doing that um, and I'm hoping that if I can make it into a habit when I go back to work, um, because I'm a teacher, when I go back to work after the summer's over, hopefully I'll continue with it um, and we can continue to save money and um, not waste as much as well. So. Um, I'm going to show you my um, meal plan and my grocery list and um, kind of how I do it when I get home and give you a grocery haul and all of that. I am shopping at Aldi today and uh, I'm going to pick up a few things from Target as well. Um, we shop at Sam's Club and BJ's as well, um, but those are pretty much the places we go. Um, Aldi. Sam's Club every once in a while, BJ's every once in a while, and then we just pick up a couple things that you can't get at Aldi or um, things that I don't want, need a lot of from BJ's or Sam's. I'll get those from like Walmart or Target. Um, so I'm not going to be going to BJ's or Sam's this week. I went last week. No, I didn't go last week. Two weeks ago I went, um, so I don't plan on going this week. Um, so I'm just gonna hit up Aldi, which I'm right here right now. Um, and then I'm gonna go to Target for a couple of things that we need and I'll catch back up with you when I get home. Okay, so I made it back home and I'm gonna show you how I've been just kind of meal planning and doing my shopping. So I've been doing this. So my husband works um, different hours and different days every week so I went through his schedule and put where um, he will be working so I could base our meal plan on that um, so where it says that he's working on those days I kind of will just like make a salad or um, do like chicken nuggets and fries or make a sandwich or something like that and just or eat leftovers you know that kind of stuff um so that's why there's nothing for the ones where it says that he's working so we have dinner for monday um garlic chicken with stuffing and zucchini chips we're not going to do zucchini chips they didn't have zucchini or actually they did but it was very limited and they all looked like crap so i didn't get them Tuesday for lunch, Tuesday and Wednesday he has off, and Sunday he has off as well. So we're going to do hot dogs and mac and cheese for lunch, and then Taco Tuesday for dinner. Wednesday we'll do a pizza for lunch, then we're going to do um, crock pot cracked chicken with broccoli, or I got some um, Hawaiian barbecue sauce, so we might do Hawaiian chicken in the crock pot instead. I'm not sure. Um, I have the stuff for both of them. Thursday he'll be working all day, so... 
I'll just kind of, you know, do whatever. Friday, we're going to do leftovers for lunch. He's working. Saturday, we'll, we'll do grilled cheese um, slash tuna melts. He doesn't like tuna, so do him a grilled cheese, and I'll do tuna melt. He has to work that night. Then Sunday, we'll do hot dogs with pasta salad, and then for dinner, we'll do spaghetti with garlic toast. So then I went through my paint. Well, I went through my pantry earlier um, and went through my list, and then I wrote down everything that we would need to make these meals based on what we already have and what we don't have. Then I took this list and I put it in my phone. So that way I would have the list. And when I do it, I break it down by store. And I know the I shop at Aldi all the time, so I know the um, the order of where everything is in the store. So then I just put everything in order. Um, and then I did Walmart. I have a, have a section for each like store that I go to, so <laughs> there's that. Um, but I got everything today from Aldi and Target. So um, there are a couple things on the list that I did not get. So let's see, for example, I did not get blueberries. Aldi was completely out and then they were like over $4 at Target. So I didn't get that. Um, didn't get zucchini. I didn't get the little veggie, little crunchies veggie stuff because Adeline's eating like regular snacks. So I didn't get those. Um, and I did not get ice cream. So I think those are the only things I did not get. So I'll show you everything I got. All right, so this is in no particular order. We're just gonna go, I just laid everything out and we're gonna go left to right. So here's our chips, Logan's favorite. We have some French onion dip in the fridge, so I got regular ones and then the boys love the barbecue. Hot dog buns for hot dogs, bread. Um, peanut butter cookies, these are like the ones for um, from Girl Scouts, so they're like a dollar. And my husband loves these, so those for him. This and here is turkey bacon for the cracked chicken if I end up doing the cracked chicken. Got some eggs, bananas, grapes, broccoli. We got some um, biscuits and some crescent rolls to go with our meals if we're feeling them. Um, blackberries, strawberries. Normally I get like two or three things of strawberries, but Aldi was completely out as well and they were kind of expensive at Target, but not too expensive to where I wouldn't buy them. So I only got one. Some tuna for tuna melts. Um, jet puffed marshmallow cream. Logan likes to put these on, well I do too, on sandwiches for peanut butter and fluff sandwiches. And I got two because I'm... Okay, you can have something in a minute, okay? Great. Yeah, you can have some grapes in a minute, okay? Great. Yeah, grapes. And then one of them is for a fruit dip that I'm gonna make. Some taco sauce. Go ahead, get you a snack. Um, teriyaki sauce. I like to dip my fries and uh, the imitation chicken nuggets from Sam's that are like uh, not imitation, imitation Chick-fil-A nuggets from Sam's. So I like to dip them in teriyaki sauce. This is the Hawaiian sauce I'm gonna try for the Hawaiian chicken. I got some pancake mix. This was not on the list, but we did need it because we just used the rest of the pancake mix the other night. Baking mix for banana bread. And then these are all the snacks for the kids. So. Peanut butter crackers. Not right now. We've got the cracker sticks with the cheese dip. All right. Fruit strips. Chocolate covered peanut butter granola bars. These are these are actually for us. Um, two types of granola bars. We got chocolate chip. Peanut butter chocolate chip. Jax loves bars. Right, Jax? Right. <laughs> Graham crackers. Cheez-Its, fruit snacks, of course. Then we've got some flavored um, tuna, which I like to put on salads. Yes, baby. Yes. Grapes. 
Yeah, you can have grapes. I Taco know. seasoning. Two types of um, instant potatoes. These are really good to have on hand too. Yeah, Cream no, cheese no. for the fruit dip. Mm. Cheese slices. What did I get these for? Oh yeah, the grilled cheese and tuna melts. These they had at Aldi, which they only have them at when it's time to go back to school. They're the snack bags. So I am not wasting as much plastic when I put together their snacks. Pop tarts. We all love these. Creamer. Um, oats for oatmeal. Adeline and I love eating oatmeal in the morning. A three pack of Velveeta, Logan's favorite. It's the only mac and cheese that he'll eat. Three gallons of milk. We go through it super fast. The Aldi brand of Red Bull, which Logan said is pretty good. Some Mountain Juice for me. I have one occasionally. Some uh, V8 Energy for Logan. And then a thing of water. So that's everything that I got to go along with our meals. Um, I think I spent like 60 something at Aldi. And then I probably spent like maybe 20 on food from Target. So like 80 bucks and all. I also got some uh, storage containers for my pantry. I am so excited. I can't wait to organize my pantry so nicely. Like it's organized, but it's not like all in bins and stuff and it doesn't all match and just got random bins in there, here and there. So I finally got some from Target and I cannot wait to organize my pantry. So it'll be a good start. I was looking at the, um, the, the, you know, the things that you put, the OXO things you put like cereal and stuff like that in. They're just expensive. So we're gonna start with this first and then we'll go from there. So, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're new and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. The seasons come and go like thoughts of you. Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue. May change, but in a cycle that I can lose. Each painful but delightful.